Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the playthrough of Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. We are on our way from Martinique, which is right about here. By the way, it's pretty cool. I can use the mouse pointer on the screen. Um, anywho, Center sits back. How can I get that mouse pointer again? Ah, over there. Alright, anyways, Martinique over here, and we are. I don't even remember. This is. Ah, this is Saint Eustatius, I think. Um, that is not island where I originally started from. I don't even remember what that one was. One second, I'm just, we have uh, nothing else to do anyways. We're just underway. Oh, by the way, we do have something to do. I can quickly check it out anyways. Uh, we started the journey. Yeah, I have no idea actually. It is in the description of the video, I'm pretty sure. here for some fuel. We can also do the next island, but we are using 83 gallons per hour and we only have... Yeah, I don't know, uh, 30 left, something, 40. And I'm also checking islands these are ah St. Bart that was where we uh, uh, started from I'm pretty sure I couldn't find it on the map actually to make a pit stop over here or do we take the chance for the next island uh, probably it's wise to do a pit stop over here on the island to the right though I don't really see it uh, there's an island over there it's pretty far away as well 
I am... Yeah, are we going to risk it? Yeah, let's just try and risk it. Screw it. Uh, there is an airfield over there. No, I'm... Yeah, shall I risk it? Yeah, I'm just gonna risk it. Screw it. Alright, we will be flying now over Montserrat and we will be landing in St. Kites, but the problem with St. Kites is it's a very It's a pretty big island, so I hope that the airfield is not all the way on the other side of it. Let's just hope for the best. Um, I just saved the game, so if all else fails, we can reload. stop as well I think that is St. Eustatius yes St. Eustatius you know I'm curious where Saba is I think it's a little bit to the northwest St. Eustatius yes so it is the second island after the next one. And now I am going to check where the airports are on St. Kites. sides so either we take that one or we fly a little bit over to the next island St. Kitts and there the airstrip is in the middle approximately of the islands and that's an international airport and Nevis also has an international airport right it looks like we will be making it Check the timer. Did I put it on? Yes. Not sure what time it is locally actually. Where the hell can I figure that out? already yeah I'm doing I'm not sure how that works with live weather and timing of course it is all live when you start it up but then you save the game and you continue the next day you load it 
will it then adopt your current time or will it be um, picking up from where you left off the day before no idea because actually I think that I started flying yesterday in the morning it seems yeah I didn't fly like eight hours I would say time it's 2136 so that's an hour off an hour and 20 minutes it's a weird amount to be uh, off but it is what it is yeah so I'm not sure what to do I will fly a little bit longer but actually I would like to continue this trip during the daytime, not by night. I want to see these islands. So I wonder if you can actually wait in the game, speed up time or something. I will check that out later. This is Nevis Island, St. Kitts is over there. And they are yeah, more or less together, St. Kitts and Nevis how they are called, what I understand. And the airfield should be over there somewhere. Holy shit. I'm not sure why the plane suddenly is veering pretty violently to the right. Well, the wind is also coming from the right. A little bit. From the front right. Alright, do we see an airport? Yes, I see it. Nice. I think we are, I'm not going to do such a messy landing like last time, I'm going to do it a little bit more controlled. I had a pretty, pretty, pretty decent landing, so uh, earlier, of course, I was already happy just to get it on the ground, and I still am. But the longer you play, the more you tend to start to pay attention to improving your um, skills. saying I have flying skills but at least improving your gameplay and here we go for the 180 
where was it? Where was that landing strip? I don't see it. Damn it. Should be straight ahead, right? Man, I don't see it. Earlier I saw it pretty clear. Is it over there to the left? No, right? Oh man, I'm such an idiot. Ah, did I see a light over there? Yes. Whoa, this is pretty weird. I've totally flown in the wrong direction. I thought... The airfield would be in that direction. It is like parallel to the coast. How weird is that? Is that the same one or... Yes, it is the same one. Right? Alright. Let's see what it says. Runway number 100. So that is in the direction of 100 degrees. The other one is then 280 degrees, I would say. And the wind is coming yeah, from this direction, so we actually need to... Lens... Man, I hardly hear the engine anymore. We need to land in the direction I was just flying. So, at least I know now the runway numbers. It's just 100. And it's an international airfield, so actually also... Stop. Indeed, um, 100 degrees is what we need. There it is. Let's tune the ATC. This is really incredibly infuriating. So I go all the way over here, and then uh, hopefully uh, this is 
this is not even what I want. How the hell can I freaking Ah, this is what I want. Alright, so why is that airport not on there? Ah, there it is. Take key PM. That's what we want. Um, so let's tune Takey PN. Tower PH ROM 885 miles east, 700 feet to land. How the hell? Where can I adjust it? Ah, that was over here, I think. Three zero zero six. So that one is set. Let's check if it also sits over there. Make left downwind runway one zero PH ROM eight eight. No, I'm not going to make any downwind stuff. I'm just gonna land straight in. But let's just not tell him that. He will notice by himself. Oh, wrong buttons. Alright, now we will be making our way to there it is, 100 degrees. Ah, no, it's actually... Ah, now I understand it. I thought the wind was coming from the opposite direction now. But we are now actually in downwind. And we need to land opposite to the wind. So I've been going into the wrong direction. Right, I'm really screwing this up. Anyways, let's get some speeds and quickly fly in the opposite direction. Then we should be all good. Gas generator has high RPM, so I am... Oh shit, the inertial separator is still on. I'm an idiot. I thought we needed runway 28 to uh, land uh, in headwinds. But it's the other way around. PH ROM 88 wind 085.25. Clear to land runway 10. Alright, nice. Clear to land runway 10 PH ROM 88. Checking out St. Kitts. Beautiful mansions over there. Check out the view, it's amazing. The Caribbean at sunset. 
imagine if you're on that yacht over there. Amazing. All right, here we go. Here we go. No more kidding around. We need 280. Or was it 10? Yeah, it was 10, I think. 100 degrees is what we need. There is the runway. Do we go around that rock or are we going to go over that rock? Let's go over it. Another yacht. Flips. Oh, wrong button. Here we go. Nice and steady. Why not? Do they have any landing systems? Like the... I forgot the name pretty funny abbreviation name with the, the red and the white light showing whether you are on the correct slope descent angle I don't see any of those so we have to do it ah there's some lights at the start of the runway they're all red I'm not sure if that's a good thing Probably a little bit high, I would say. And I'm going full flaps. Get that speed down. Yeah, I'm way too high. Holy shit. And flare up. Off. Do I still have? Yeah, all right. At least I have the hut now activated as opposed to that earlier. Uh, airfield where we started in the previous episode. So I will, because if I save the game. Tower PH ROM 88, cancel landing intention. Cancel. PH ROM 88, your cancellation is received. Uh, sorry, I didn't want to cancel my landing intentions. I want to taxi off the runway, but... 
I don't really see where I can get off this runway. Ground PHROM 88 request taxi to parking. <laughs> 